I promised you five new RV reveals in one day. We are in brand new motorhome number three. This is the Resonate 32B. I'm glad you're with us today. I am Steve Duval from Thor Motor Coach. We are coming to you live in Elkhart, Indiana at the RV Hall of Fame for the Thor Industries Dealer Open House. Today, nothing but new models. We talked vans, big Class A, another Class A. This is gonna be on par with your Ace. It's family friendly, it is feature rich, and we have two Resonates to show you. We are starting in the 32B. This is the bunkhouse, 84 inches of ceiling height in here. So plenty of room to walk, to move about, to live. Uh, right now, Tom's got a picture of your 13.5 BTU AC units. You do have one in the front and one in the rear. And I will show you where you control these as we walk through. What we're gonna do is start right over here with the Dream Dinette. This, this is called Network Gray, by the way. The decor that you're seeing is Network Gray. Dream Dinette, you know how much I love the Dream Dinette. I will always choose the Dream Dinette because of its versatility. You have seat belts in here for the ride. Child safety tether in here as well. So when you travel with all of the little ones, what you need to do is get them started young, get them started camping young. And it is going to be a great time as they get older. They're going to say, ah, oh, I remember I remember when we did this. I remember this and I remember that. And they will take those memories and pass those on to their children as well. This is the Dream Dinette with storage down below. Oh, look at that. Makes into a bed real easy. All you have to do is flip the handle. Push down, and make sure you turn it the right way. There you go, you now have a bed. So this makes into a bed. This is also a great place to charge your phone. Right back here, you move the adult beverage. Wireless charging right here. If your phone does not support wireless charging, you have a USB-A and a USB-C port down below so you can plug in. Any device there, cup holders for the ride, you're sitting back, you're watching TV, yep, entertainment, all on board. And what's great about the way that the Resonate is set up is you have an uh, HDMI cord over here, so you can throw, uh, maybe it's a streaming device, or maybe it is a gaming console, and now you can stream or play video games along the way. Hook up your cable right here, and because you have the WineGuard Connect 4G hotspot and Wi-Fi extender, you now have Wi-Fi when you are on the road, no matter where you happen to travel, through your favorite carrier or through WineGuard, you get a data plan, and then you install the SIM card up top, and now you have a hotspot, and you can also use that to tap into nearby Wi-Fi signals when you're at the campground. Lovely jackknife sofa. Folds into a bed just like that, and the seat belt's in here for the ride, and then when you're done, pop it right back into the sofa. Nice shelf back here. You got cup holders right here for the drinks, you have your nice privacy shades right here, reading lights, speakers, right? You can pump in some music from the radio, USB-A charging ports here, so plenty of places to charge your phones and your devices. 110s over here, working our way back, solid surface countertops in the kitchen, microwave, three burner gas cooktop, where you can make 125 ground meat recipes. It's a scatty time right here on the cookbook. Whatever you wanna make on the stove, in the oven. Maybe you're making spaghetti, garlic bread in the oven, heating up a side in the microwave. What's nice about this sink, with the way the covers are removable, it's a double stainless steel sink. So you're washing up in here, you're using this side maybe as a cutting board, a little extra prep area. And then you have so much storage down below. One, two, three, four drawers here. Large drawer right over here. So you have all kinds of storage in your Resonate 32B. Of course you're gonna have a refrigerator and a freezer. Look at the size of this. Everything you need right in here. Ice cream, snacks, juice, all your faves. Control panel, let's go over this real quick. You can start and stop your generator from here. You have a meter that tells you how many hours are in it. Shore power fault, if you plug in and there's a fault at camp, you get some janky juice, as I like to call it. 
this will light up and you'll know, okay, hmm, janky juice, got to take care of that. Take care of your tanks right here. Check your levels for your battery, your propane, your fresh water, your black water, and your gray water. Extend and retract your slides here. Turn your water pump on for your water heater. Propane will always be your main source, so turn that on. 110 volt, yep, you're going to want that on too. That'll maintain it. This will heat it up. And your water pump needs to be on when you are dry camping, but when you're hooked up to city water, you don't need to turn that on. We talked about those dual ACs. This controls the one right up front. As we work our way back, residential vinyl floor, easy to clean. Sweep it right out with the Swiffer. How about some bunks? We got them for you. Look at this, how thick this mattress is nice and thick, great for sleeping. And when you move your backpack, because everybody's got a lot of stuff, tablet holder, USB-A charging ports, 110. You have the same down below. You have window shades here as well. And then you can pull the curtain. Everybody that was in the bunks is happy. They have their own spot. Let's step into the bathroom here, if you would please, Tom. Porcelain toilet there. You have the curved shower door medicine cabinet, sink, everything you need is in here, your GFCI outlet as well. So if something's not working right in one of the other outlets, come check that here. And the other thing I want to point out in here, you got towel rack, you have shelves, storage, and you have the shower miser. What's great about the shower miser when you're dry camping is you don't want to take and waste space in your gray tank, right? So you grab this and you're standing here and you're doing this until the water gets hot while you're filling up your gray tank. With the shower miser, what you do is you turn the valve, right? And after you turn the valve, this will eventually turn to a bluish shade of white when the water gets hot and then you crack that open. Now you're getting the hot water and you have not filled up your gray tank with water, just wasting space. The shower miser. So you showered, you take a nice hot shower, king size bed, gonna lull you to sleep. You have 12 volt USB charging ports over here. A couple of drawers down below, three cabinets up above. You have reading lights back above the bed. Another TV back here and talk about space. All right, so you have all the hanging space in the closet. Ladder for the bunks, ladder for the drop down overhead bunk. You can really pack them in in this when it comes to family adventures. In one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight drawers. Control for your rear thermostat. Some light switches, USB-A charging, and another GFCI, and even more storage back here behind the TV. So you have storage galore in the 32B. Let's step outside, take a quick tour line. Tour line. Other brand new Resonate floor plan, a little different layout in there. A lot of the same great features. Watch your head, Tom. All right. So here we are outside. Nice big awning with an LED light strip. You can put that out and you're setting up the camping chairs. You're watching uh, the exterior TV we'll get to. Here's your fresh water fill. We'll go over tank levels when we get up to the outside of the 30C. Nice large storage bays back here. They are durable. They are rotocast, so they're easy to clean. They lock just a twist. Another great large storage bay. Now each bay has its own light. 19 and a half inch tires. 110, you need to have your uh, generator running or be plugged into shore power to get those fired up. Another large storage bay. Exhaust for your furnace. Inside the door here, uh, you have your solar controller for 100 watts of optional solar. Uh, generator start on this, or awning in and out, battery disconnect switch, just make sure that that is on and stays on. And a switch for your step, so the step will stay out whenever you open and close the door. This is great when you're set up. You even have a little storage down here below. So a lot of storage options inside and out. As we walk around here, yes, another storage bay. Look how much storage you have on this. You know, let's look up and see exactly how much. This is new, so I brought my sheets so you will know exactly as I do, because I'm learning about this today. So we have 71 
cubic feet of storage on this. And our tanks, we have 50 fresh, 40 gray, and 40 black. Oh, you know what? I know what else you want to know. You want to know your occupant and cargo carrying capacity. Look at that, 3,972 pounds. That is a lot, a lot of goodies. And you're looking at 33 and a half feet on the 32B. Our exterior TV is right here. So the awning's out, the camping chairs are set up. You are connected to the exterior propane connection with a fire pit or a grill or a griddle and you are enjoying the outside. We got batteries, we got breakers, we got a pet tie down right in there. Maybe lock up the bikes as well if you don't travel with pets. Pet window, if you do travel with pets, they can set up shop right here look out and enjoy the ride and wave to all the other dogs who don't get to travel in a resonate. That one paw wave, the one paw wave. V8 under the hood, 335 horsepower, 468 pound feet of torque. Now we're moving on to the 30C. This is the other resonate floor plan. This one has an exterior kitchen. You're gonna have an inverter in here, 1000 watt inverter, shelves, storage drawers. This is the home collection that you see. Here's your exterior propane connection right here. Make sure your propane is on. That is over on the other side. Detachable 50 amp shore power cord. You can keep it anywhere. We'll show you where to plug in when we hit the business end of the Resonate. Fresh water fill is right here. Again, you have 110s right here. The battery and breaker bay. And inside, this is going to be, we got, a, we got a meeting set in. Can we get in here real quick? We won't show you on camera. I know you guys are set up. I don't want to kick you out. No. You, can be, you can be my live studio audience. You, you don't want to be live studio audience? Uh, are you yeah. sure? We'll be five minutes. Five minutes. Okay, four minutes for you. Three minutes for you. All right. 30C, I want to get these guys back in here, all right? King bed. Nice king bed, a lot of storage, massive closet on here. Again, a lot of the same features we just showed you. Three pantry, three doors for your pantry here. There's your double door fridge. Another nice shower in here with the porcelain foot flush toilet. You have your microwave, you have your stove, the home collection, the sofa, the dinette. Let's go outside and we'll talk and let all these folks back in here because we are again live. This is the dealer open house. The dealers want to see this as well. You can find more on 4motorcoach.com. All right, Joel, I'm going to let your gang back in there. All right, we'll let them all go back in there and explore. You have a TV as well. Brandon's answering questions on the other end of this on the social media platforms, by the way. We have more storage here, backpack not included. Another bay there, that backpack is included. No, I don't, I don't know, I don't know whose it is. Working our way through, excuse me gents, just working our way through. Everybody's gathered around the Resonate because it is such a fantastic, awesome, easy motorhome. We have plants blowing away because it is a very windy fall day in Elkhart, Indiana. Under the hood, 7.3 liter, 335 force, 468 pound-feet of torque, six-speed transmission, the infotainment center, much like the ones that we've showed you with Apple CarPlay, uh, Android Auto, Sirius XM satellite radio, Bluetooth connectivity. So it's everything you need for great adventures on the road. Let's walk over to the business end, move our ferns out of the way, and over here it's a little quieter. All right, so we got, oh, let's get under here. This is why when we do our other videos, we typically close it up for you so you get a better look in here. We have another large storage bay here. You have another large storage bay here. I'm telling you, this is packed with storage. Now, this has more storage. Let's look at the cheat sheet. Give you the exact amount. So you got 100, and, 100 cubic feet of storage on the 30C. I think I just opened that one. We got another bay right over here. This is going to be our tank flush over here. You do have a macerating system on here. This is our 
HD Max that you're seeing right here. Uh, what's nice about the HD Max is that it is the solid color piece of fiberglass. So if you get a little scratch right up front, it's gonna be much easier to repair. You're not gonna see a different color underneath. And the way we put these walls together, we take the inner wall board, the uh, aluminum frame, the block foam insulation, and the piece of fiberglass, and they are, we adhesive them together, and then we put them in a sleeve, and we run them through our lamination machine for about a half an hour or so, and you have this nice cable, propane right here. You can always tell it's propane when it has the double latches on the resonate. Storage bay right up here, perfect for camping chairs. And you have your quiet gas 4,000 watt generator. So it's gonna be very, very similar as we work our way down the other resonate with a lot of storage bays out here. Uh, your generator, so the sides are, are, are pretty much the same. But this is it, this is the resonate two models two models. If you want more information, that would be thormotorcoach.com. Find all as well, the Indigo. And now we have the Resonate. Two more left. That'll be in about a couple hours. Keep it right here. Whatever social media